today is a sad day. Not for you guys. No, I'm not even going to say it's a sad day, okay? All I'm saying is today is the last day of my 20s. And I mean, I'm not, I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad about being 30 because like 30, flirty and thriving, even though I am a, the only one of those I am is 30. I'm not flirty or thriving in any manner. So I'm off work today, which is nice because I'm on call tomorrow for my birthday. So I can not get stuff done um, and avoid everything. So far today, I've gotten up, did not go to the gym because I was at work until like 8, 8.30 last night. Awesome, huh? Um, but I did get up, slept in, felt great. I have my training tonight though, so that's why I didn't feel because I've not went to the gym at all this week. I am not ending twenty I'm not ending my twenties on a good note because I haven't gone to the gym at all this week. <laughs> but I have my training tonight, so I'll probably die tonight. I may not make it to thirty. But right now I just got home. I got my nails done. I'll show you. I didn't get to show you my nails from last week, which I really like too. So I'll make sure to show you my nails from this week. Um I just made a nice coffee and I'm making some beef stir fry Chinese whatever oh look at that like oh my it's a ghost a ghost um but yeah I just made a nice coffee in my instant pot blender I'm super excited but it's only my second cup of the day I'm trying so yeah I'm waiting for that to get done and I'm gonna have lunch and then I'm probably just gonna do nothing and then I'm gonna switch into my workout clothes and uh yeah then I'll be ready I'll be ready. Yeah. I don't know. I just wanted to do a vlog today as instead of because I know I won't be able to do anything. Not that I'm interesting at all, but I'm not gonna be doing anything tomorrow for my birthday, which is kind of upsetting because nobody's gonna come over here to see me and I can't go really any, anywhere really because I'm on call. We're doing something on Friday and we're going somewhere on Saturday. So it's not like, oh, it's finally starting after like 20 minutes. Did you hear that? Dangerous. But yeah, I'm just gonna lounge around today, do nothing until I go to training. Hopefully not die. And that's about it. So I'll check in with you later. So I wanna show you my nails, ignore my junk. While I still have them fresh, I got like a dark maroon burgundy color. I don't know what you would call it. And Sam said it was my golden birthday because my birthday's on Thursday the 30th and I'm turning 30. So I got gold glitter. These are definitely colors that I would not usually get because I like I like bright colors and I don't like gold, but I'm really liking it so far. Oh hi, 30 flirty and thriving shirt. That's probably gonna be too small, but I'm gonna still wear it on Saturday. And I didn't plan to match my shirt. I thought I got a light pink, but apparently I didn't. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I like them. It's like it's a little more simple than the picture I showed them, but I'm fine because I'm not like super into it. I wanted to get some gems, but I figured. If I get gems, they'll come off at work, so I just went for this, and I like it a lot so far. So I just want to add that there was a reason I had to go to the store today, just like the horse store or whatever, but I couldn't remember why, so I didn't go. I just came right home, and I realized just now that I ran out of toilet paper. <laughs> Luckily, my training's in an hour, and I can go afterwards, but I'm thinking, Amber, you dumb bitch. <laughs> Why didn't you think of that earlier? I could have wrote it on my phone. I could have made a list. And I still would have forgot it. So. I'm feeling pretty good about that. <laughs> okay. So I am getting ready to go to training. I'm not excited. Because I just, I feel so tired today. My back hurts. Every day. I don't know. I'm just not feeling it I never feel it ever I always get nervous before I go and yeah, I don't know I don't like it but when I'm done I feel really good so it's hard to tell I don't know so we'll see I'll be back after with even more red face I think that's why I get nervous because I'm like I'm, I'm too worried about how I look when I do it like body wise and face wise like I just I don't know I just feel like I suck but he would never say that he would be like no no <laughs> you're 
doing perfectly fine. But yeah, I don't know. We're going to see what happens. Hopefully I survive. If this vlog doesn't make it out, that means I didn't survive. I'm sorry. All right. I did it. I survived training. Honestly, going in, I told you my hair is even worse than it was when I started. I said, like, I just felt off and weird, and that did not help. I, I don't know. It, it was just, we did different things than we have already. I almost died a couple times. I made it through. And at one point, I can tell, like, it's not really that I want to cry because I want to cry. It's more of an embarrassed cry, like, because I don't want him, you know, I don't know. Cause I know he knows he's like good job when we're done he's like good job not crying good back home the tears I'm like great now I'm gonna start crying now because you fucking mentioned it but he can be very inspirational when he wants to and I tell him I'm like listen I'm gonna bitch and I'm gonna complain and I'm just gonna say I can't do it but I'll do it or at least try my best to do it but I just felt like tonight like since it was things that were completely different than huge I felt really out of my comfort zone and I felt like I looked awful doing them like people watching me were probably like what the hell I looked awful like we did this one thing where we were in like on a box and playing position we use those like the little discs they I call them couch movers and we had to do like jumping jacks in a plank position kind of and let me tell you I didn't have to see myself to know that it was awful but I made it through and I was like, I don't know if it's just, um, I, cause I felt off today and I was like, I just don't know if it's because my birthday's tomorrow and it's the last day of my twenties. And he's like, you know, I didn't remember you telling me that, but for some reason I just felt the number 30. Like I wanted to have you do something 30 times, like over and over. And I'm like, well, good. 30, 30, <laughs> but I made it. And he's probably like, when I leave, he's probably like, thank God that basic white bitch that's annoying as hell is gone. <laughs> but yeah, I made, made it through training though I did I did stop and get my toilet paper I will tell you I did get my toilet paper so we don't have to worry about that and I don't know I got SpaghettiOs which defeats the whole purpose of going to the fucking gym but I don't know I want my last meal of my 30s I mean my half my 30s Jesus I want my last meal of my 20s to be SpaghettiOs because that's what I ate a lot especially like in 2018 the year after, you know, even last year. I just wanted to be my last SpaghettiOs and just get them out of my system in 30s. Now I want to start to cry. I don't want to. Because I'm sitting in my car in my parking lot and people are probably like looking out their windows like, what are you doing? But I just want my 20s to be over with. And to forget all the things that happened in my 20s. Like, 20 years was supposed to be, like, good years, and I wasted half of mine. So, I just want to, in my 30s, it's going to be about me. And I, if I can say that about me, but I just want to forget my late 20s. Um, I'm going to go now because this is embarrassing. But, yeah, I just want my 20s to be over with, and I wish you could forget everything that happened in your 20s, or at least pick yours it to delete. So we're just going to ignore the last bit of that last clip, though it's correct. I am, since my workout, I was emotional, like, I get it, I'm emotional about the subject anyway. And I started crying and then I got birthday cards in the mail and I was sitting there opening them. And it's not like they're extra sentimental or anything, they're like the same birthday cards that I always get. And I started crying. And I'm like, Amber, stop. I just can't. My hair is a disaster. Hi. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm sitting here. But people, people know. There's glitter on the cards. Like, I, the one that got me was the one my grandma and pap got me. How it's, there's makeup and beauty stuff on it and glitter. So I don't know why that just, that just hit me harder than usual. And I'm like, you know what? Maybe my goal for my 30s is to be less emotional, like care about myself more, but like stop giving so many fucks. I don't know, <laughs> but we'll see. I, I don't know. 
it's hard to tell what's gonna happen but uh yeah we'll see and I know like I know this vlog has been like not interesting and it's been it's not that long and I didn't really do anything but like I said it's just kind of like a it's the last day of my 20s it's like I'm totally I'm going into a new decade new decade 2020 new decade of 30s like it's everything together so yeah I don't know maybe that's why it's just everything is just going crazy so yeah I mean I don't know I'm excited for tomorrow to turn 30 I just hope that I can make it through work I'm on call so I'm not doing anything I think I said that earlier I don't know did I once again luckily my memory is going downhill already awesome but yeah I I'm on call so I'm not doing anything tomorrow maybe dinner I don't know but just be by myself that's how I am though starting my brand new year by myself anyway thank you guys for watching and thank you guys for like putting up with my crap this is basically just me being emotional and stupid and I'm glad I had the day off to just collect myself do what I wanted to do and even though I didn't do anything special or spectacular I'm ending my 20s on a good note a positive note even though like I cried a little <laughs> but I ended it with a workout I ended it with spaghettios I ended it with you know my cards so I don't know I think it's gonna be a good start to the 30s we'll see this weekend will be a test of that we'll see if I can drink more than one beer without getting sick because you know as you age it just gets more difficult Anyways, I love you guys and thank you so much for watching. Until next time, bye.